Welcome to UOIT's Teaching and Learning Center's Teachtorial on Turnitin. This is one screencast in a series of tutorials designed to help you get started with Turnitin and become proficient at interpreting the results of Turnitin service, the Originality Report. Turnitin is an internet-based plagiarism detection service. In an effort to ensure the highest academic standards, the University of Ontario Institute of Technology, UOIT, has made a strong commitment to preserve academic integrity as defined by UOIT policies. This currently includes the use of Turnitin. How does Turnitin work? Turnitin uses proprietary search technology to compare the textual similarity of student assignment submissions. Each submission is compared with over 14 billion pages of web content, more than 90,000 subscription-based journals or periodicals, and more than 150 million student paper submission. These numbers continue to grow on a daily basis. The system operates under all relevant laws and is used by more than a million instructors in 126 countries. As part of its license agreement with UOIT, Turnitin will purge its database of all UOIT student assignments every five years. Turnitin creates an originality report that records passages from the paper that might not be authentic and searches through websites and other resources and compiles similar contents that match the student paper submitted. Who can upload to Turnitin? Both faculty members and students can upload their assignments to the database. Policies now require students to upload their assignments to your assignment drop box on the Turnitin website. However, if a student has passed the deadline or needs assistance, faculty members can also upload assignments. Students must first register at http colon forward slash forward slash www.turnitin.com as a new user with their email address and a password. They are then connected to your assignment Dropbox via the classroom number and password that you set up for the assignment. No corporate login information is required. How long does it take for Turnitin to check an updated paper? Turnitin will check a paper against the database and generate an originality report in an hour or less. The 24-hour turnaround option allows students to resubmit a paper as many times as they wish within a 24-hour window, giving students the ability to correct any errors or omissions that they may have made. How are papers uploaded to Turnitin? To upload a paper into Turnitin, you and your students must log into your respective Turnitin accounts and find the appropriate class. Then you can either copy and paste the paper into a text box and click Submit, or browse for a file and click Submit. You can submit papers in Microsoft Word, plain text, rich text format, PDF, or postscript formats. Is a paper that receives a high similarity rating necessarily plagiarized? Turnitin does not detect plagiarism. Rather, it detects a like text. A section that is found to be similar to another source may be properly cited and attributed to match that source. Therefore, determining true plagiarism requires a human analysis. If a submission is found to contain plagiarized elements, then the appropriate procedures will be followed. Consequences and detection of plagiarism are outlined on the UOIT Academic Integrity website. You will also find UOIT's statement on Turnitin at that site. It is your student's responsibility to understand UOIT's standard of academic integrity. You can help by reminding students to review the UOIT academic policies and help students through the Turnitin submission process. What are the benefits of using Turnitin? Students will now be able to cite sources appropriately and become familiar with the process of paraphrasing. 
This promotes a fair environment that respects the intellectual property of others while appropriately building upon their research. And what if a student does not feel comfortable having their work submitted to turn it in? Students have the right to object to the use of the service. If that is the case, he or she must inform you within two weeks of the beginning of the course. Your student may be permitted to use alternate methods of verifying the originality of assignments as agreed upon by you. This includes the submission of all rough drafts and annotated bibliography of sources consulted. This concludes our tutorial on Turnitin. What is Turnitin? Thank you for viewing.